Elvira's back. Welcome to a new episode. Hello. Elvira's finally back from a near five week journey away, just sitting on a garage forecourt. Um, suddenly I got a phone call yesterday. I, I'd only just washed the Nero EV because um, I was doing some filming with it and uh, said to Salt's Law, I wash it whilst I'm washing the car. They phone up, it's ready. Uh, but it needed charging overnight, so they've charged it up for me and uh, got it got it back and it's all good. Um, it's also got the iPedal update, which I'll show you now. I'll go to drive and then just press parking brake to pride automatically. So the iPedal update's been put on. Um, I've had a quick run through with car scanner to see what's changed and looking at the old dashboard module um, which is an ECU serial number of 2021-0906 that's September 21 the new one has got a date of 2023-0718 so that shows it's a brand new unit so uh, I wonder when I get to test the battery preconditioning will I get a coil in there? I bet I will but um, we've suddenly gone from 15, 18 degrees for weeks on end with drizzle and rain to a heat wave. It's 27 today, so I can't get the battery preconditioning test. So I've got to wait for it to cool down before I can discover whether that is there. So, uh, so you can see in my notes that it's changed. Also, looking through the uh, the ECU dump on car scanner, the old VCU. You've got calibration verification numbers have changed and the calibration ID's changed. So you've got the old at the top and the new underneath. So I think that's one way you can see it's changed. Also, I've got an old image from engineering mode from, from my previous version, and that says VCU 5.6. And if I go into engineering mode now with the new method, it's the first time I've done it on the EV6. Um, you'll see that that's changed as well. There's an old setup. System info, memory, and then it's tappy tappy time again. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then the code of 19450815. And OK. And then under software and control version. And scroll down to VCU. And it's changed from 5.6 to 5.12. I've looked back at the iPedal. Uh, technical service bulletin and uh, the ROM version numbers don't tie up with any of those numbers in there but those are the things that have changed and that's how I proved it's changed and the fact that if you press park it now applies the handbrake just like it did in the Nero EV as well anyway those are things that's changed um, I've got another visit booked next week to have another look at trying to get my active sound design working by swapping out the amp for another amp to see if the menu will come back. Um, so we'll see how we got on with that. Anyway, I hope you found this information useful. Thanks for watching.